We have a Pixel 5. Google Pixel phones are arguably one of the easiest phones to fix when it comes to screen replacements. iFixit rated this phone's screen replacement difficulty as moderate, which I would argue is slightly inaccurate. This phone has the same repairability as the iPhone 13 Pro for one main reason. If you were to attempt any other repair, even a simple battery replacement, you're likely to break the screen in the process. You don't really need any tools to complete this repair, just glue. This Google Pixel 5 has a broken display and a broken camera glass. Let's fix it up. So let me show you just how easy this repair is. I'm gonna be doing the screen replacement without any tools, nothing, absolutely nothing. I'm gonna begin by using my nails to separate the OLED from the frame. This is literally the only reason I have long-ish nails. Open it up. And that is our Google Pixel 5. The OLED is still really easy to break, but it's harder to break than older generations. Now we have to lift this metal bracket off and we can just remove the screen. Also, this is a phone I bought off eBay, not a customer's phone, so don't worry. We'll take our new display, and now we have to transfer the camera bracket, the speaker, and the frame. We are going to have to use glue, but we still haven't used any tools, technically. If you are doing this at home, this is the standard glue most phone repair technicians use, B7000 or T7000. We'll start off by removing the frame. We're gonna install some adhesive around the edges of the new screen so that we can reinstall the frame. We're gonna leave this for a few minutes and let that glue dry. Honestly, for a moment, I thought I couldn't do this without tools, but this just goes to show how easy this replacement actually is. Of course, if you are attempting this, please do it at your own risk, and please use tools. Don't be like me, I'm just doing this for fun. The glue is set and everything is good to go. Now we have to transfer over the camera bracket as well as the front earpiece speaker. This should be easy. I just reached for my Jimmy tool. I forgot I was doing this without tools. That was easy. That was easy. That Stop! Are you subscribed? We're so close to 3 million. Hit that subscribe button and help me get to 3 million. Anyway, we're gonna use the same glue, apply it to the camera lens and where the earpiece speaker should go, and we'll be good to go. To make sure that the earpiece speaker is making contact with the points, because there's still residue adhesive, we're gonna leave it here, and we're going to makeshift install the screen just enough so that the speaker will stick to the screen so we know exactly where it should go. This is a high IQ play. So it needs to go right over here. Perfect. Now we'll re-glue the front camera bracket. Remove the old adhesive. I can't believe this is actually working. Reinstall the adhesive around the edges of the phone. Now we can fully install the new screen. And we're done. I just replaced this phone screen without using any tools, just some glue. I'm gonna be doing the back camera glass in an upcoming short video, stay tuned for that. If you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, hit that bell notification button, and I'll see you guys in the next one.